On Friday night in New York City, Angelina Jolie delighted her fans by promoting her movie Maria. Jolie spent over 15 minutes chatting with fans, signing autographs, and taking photographs with them after a screening of the biopic Maria, in which she plays opera icon Maria Callas. The 49-year-old Oscar winner, who might receive nominations from other award shows for her performance, grinned for the cameras while wearing an attractive black outfit. She had a delicate pink lip and natural-looking makeup, and her long, golden hair was brushed straight. Pablo Larraín, the director of other films like Jackie, 2016, and Spencer, 2021, directed Maria. International celebrities Pierre Francesco Favino, Alba Rohrwacher, Haluk Bilgener, and Cody Smith-McPhee are among the other cast members of Maria, in addition to Jolie. The biopic made its debut at the 81st Venice International Film Festival in August, where it was a Golden Lion contender. Maria Calls, the world's best opera singer, is the main character of the movie. It focuses on the last days of her life in 1970s Paris, as she confronts her identity and life, according to an IMDb profile. In an August interview with the reporter, Angelina talked candidly about playing Collis and learning to sing for the movie. Singing lessons were required for several months. After months of practicing singing, she had to take Italian classes, work on her voice, and do all these things like her. You make an effort to be exact, she clarified. Almost everyone should take an opera class, in my opinion, to be alive and never have performed as loudly as you possibly could with your entire body. Jolie went on, I believe we should all experience it. We are rarely asked to do it, and it is frightening. In life, we are rarely expected to be or feel everything that we are capable of. The director of the movie disclosed that Jolie moved him to tears during the filming of a particularly challenging moment. That was what we did on the final day of filming. We held on to it till the very end. We were given six to eight hours to complete that. I was always close to her because I operated the camera, Lorraine remarked. With all of her strength and compassion, Angelina had to sing it aloud. I wanted her to experience the emotion and realize how broken she was in this happy moment, he explained. I was stunned. Her burning herself to the point where I believe the film ends in an operatic fashion brought me to tears. The film will be released on Netflix on December 11th, after a limited theatrical run in the U.S. starts on November 27th.